Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you what you can do if your Elgato doesn't get detected or doesn't show up on your Streamlabs OBS. So this is quite a easy fix what you can do and it could happen that you some have some couple problems or some mistakes and that's why it doesn't connect. So the first thing that you want to check out if it's connected right. So on the input, we have our HDMI connected like you see over here to our PC. So the HDMI on the input is connected to our PC. And next to our input, we have our USB-C. The USB-C has to be connected also with your PC. So over here to your USB 3.0 port, right over here, right over there. So now, once you have connected it, it's really simple. Just leave it like on here, for example. I'm just gonna leave it here. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm going ahead and go over to source. I'm also gonna give you some tips, guys. So if you go to add source, and now if you go to here, so you have two types what you can add. Game capture and you have video capture device. So if you wanna record your desktop, for example, you wanna select on video capture device. So let's do that. Add source, add, go to Elgato Game Capture 8060. And now what you can do is you can capture your desktop and stuff like that. So let's make this smaller, click on done. And let me show you. So like you see, it records stuff like that. And you can like just fit to screen read easily. So transform, fit to screen. And now it just fitted to screen. And you can do some more stuff like maybe record this display over here or something else really easily. And once I move it to somewhere else, it actually records this display over here. And once I open this back up on this display and move this to over here, it's gonna start recording this display over here. It's kind of a bit confusing, but you will understand it later on. Now let's go to the next option. Let me delete this. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to this plus option and I'm going to game capture. So this is where a lot of people have a problem and it shows always on black. Add source, add it. And now you will get this looking for a game to capture. So what you want to do always, guys, is you want to open a game. So it doesn't really matter which game it is. It could be Roblox, it could be uh, Black Ops. I'm just going to open a really simple game that doesn't require a long waiting time. So let me open something like Roblox. I just opened Roblox. Let's open it up. Let's do something random. Open it up. And now it should appear also on your screen. So it opens up on here. Let's see. Now, okay, now it just appeared. So like you see guys, that's how you can get your screen over here. And guys, if you don't see anything still yet, if you still have like a black screen or nothing, what you can do is you can go to the options of your game. And like I said, it doesn't matter which game that you are playing, go over to your option, just escape and go to settings, go to graphic settings, or I don't know, and go to full screen. Make sure that full screen is on guys. If it's not on, it's maybe not even gonna detect your game itself. So that's what you wanna make sure of is that. And now what you also can do is you can select something specific, for example, go to capture specific window. And now on here, you can select something else. Like for example, this or something else like my OBS studios and stuff like that, guys, like you see. Now it's actually capturing my yeah, OBS studios. So this is how easy it actually is, guys. And this is how you can do it. 
and this is how we can fix the black screen or not detecting on the Elgato problem. So I hope you enjoyed the video guys. This is really easy to fix. Just make sure that your Elgato is good. Make sure that you have it connected to the right thing and you want to make sure that you have the right uh, source selected. So take care guys, you can subscribe, like, that will really help me out. And also guys, you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram, I'll leave a link in the description down below. Also, if you have questions, just drop them in the comments down below. Take care guys and goodbye.